Welcome to the Boathouse of Anaheim. You're looking at the all new 2020 Illumicraft 185 Tournament Pro with black and blue hull color. As you can see it's got a very deep V, allows for a very smooth ride. This boat does not pound, it cuts through the waves with ease. You notice the spray rails along the side. That helps keep you dry on those real windy days. And you can see the deep V hull and the extruded keel. So if you do have to beach the boat, it's gonna hit that first before it will the hull. Very wide boat, 95 inch beam. You see it's got the area in the bow for mounting any trolling motor be a motor guide, Garmin, or a Minn Kota. It's already pre-wired for 12 or 24 volt system. The big casting decks in the front. The 185 Tournament Pro also has a double plated bottom, so it's twice as thick as most of our competitors. delivers a excellent smooth ride and very very quiet this boat is rigged with the 140 horsepower Suzuki Electronic fuel injection, four stroke, incredible power, allows for water skiing, and most other tow sports, and delivers excellent speed. Do the boarding ladder for getting back into the boat, made easy. This is also equipped with hydraulic steering. So you don't have to fight the torque of the motor, nor will you ever have to worry about another frozen steering cable. The 185 Tournament Pro has very wide gunnels with storage underneath. Pop-up cleats. So the bow area on the 185 Tournament Pro, as you can see, it's very roomy, lots of storage compartments. There's a recirculating live well, which also has a light in it. In the center, that is where the rods will store. You have another base in the front for the chair to come up in the front. So if you do put a trolling motor on it, you can operate the trolling motor. On the starboard side of the bow, we have this big lined compartment. You can use it for a fish hold, you can use it for dry or wet storage. It also has a lock, so if you have to put something in for security, you can you have a key for the latch. This is the main cockpit of the 185 Tournament Pro. Very wide, very roomy, lots of storage. We have the flip up rear seats in the open position and in a minute we'll close them down and fold it over and it gives you an extended casting deck at the rear of the boat. There's two additional bases in the floor. It comes standard with three seats. Additional seats are available.
Lots of room for your favorite electronics, whether you want a bracket mount or flush mount. A real nice custom heavy duty steering wheel, which also tilts. And then an Infinity sound system with aux and a USB input. The passenger side has a place for your phone, a glove box, and more storage below. The windshield opens up to easy in and out. And then here in the floor is where our rods are stored at. As you can see, it's got a nice courtesy light for those pre-dawn or evening fishing trips. Lots of leg room under the console here, which also, if you have additional duffel bags, tackle, tackle storage as well. Your main panel, if you notice all circuit breakers. The helm, you have additional cup holders and trays for miscellaneous items. The Infinity sound system is also Bluetooth. Boat's graded for six persons. Our maximum is 1,600 pounds. Let's open up the storage box here where the rods would go. Also have a lock on it as well. Now we have place here for your rods with a max length up to seven foot six inches. Have a subfloor where you'll find access to the trolling batteries. You got the gas filled shocks for support. So if you're in getting your rods, you could do it single handedly. a great boat for the entire family whether you're a hardcore fisherman or just weekend warriors a great platform to get out on the water and relax so this is the rear flip up seats as you notice we've got cup holders and grab handles so when you're underway this is the seat back slipped over so you can step on them whether you're getting in or out of the boat. And then real easily this whole com area converts over. So now we have a big casting deck. This compartment in the back. There's also a recirculating live well. So you have one in the front and one in the rear. On the other side, we have storage and a place for your cranking battery. Access to open and closed your live wells and an additional power outlet for our trolling motor plug or downriggers. This is another locking compartment over on this side, on the port side. It's long and will accommodate additional four more rods. And additional storage.
also has a locking hatch so valuables or things that you want to keep safe while you're away from your boat would be a good place to put them a big glove box also locks you can put a lot of stuff in this one You notice on the port and starboard side we have an area underneath. What that's going to allow us to do is when you're standing there either netting your fish or fighting your fish and you've got some rough rough water you can hook your toes underneath there to give you a little extra support and help you keep your balance. We have one of the chairs now in the bow. Very easy to move the seats back and forth. And speaking of these seats, they are very, very comfortable. I've sat in a lot of manufacturer's chairs over the years, and these have to be the most comfortable chairs. Another handy storage compartment on the starboard side. Miscellaneous gear. Has a grommet in there to hold our anchor wand, anchor light, or whatever you like to put in there. Additional area to mount a secondary control box if you had a small auxiliary motor for trolling for some of the areas in the Pacific Northwest, like for salmon. Five will make a great boat. Check it out at boathouseofanheim.com. There's some fantastic rebates from the manufacturer and promotions from the engine brand Suzuki. We can make you a great deal on this boat. Just give us a call.